just wipe I it. I stored my mini fridge this summer without oh, electricity and now there's some mold in it. Ew! Oh Hi everybody, it's Diana. Welcome to my second move-in vlog. In this year's vlog, my brother Atticus will also be moving to Penn. Way to the airport. We just had the nicest woman ever help us check in because we had 10 bags, all 40 pounds. We are in Sydney. We have all our stuff. Nat and I finally got to our hotel. We're going to sleep and then move in tomorrow morning. It is the morning of our move-in day. We're on our way to CVS to pick up some cleaning supplies. For what reason? Please scan it now. <laughs> Quick breakfast. To go to Uber and we are now on Penn's campus. This year I'm living in Harnwell. We have a nice view of Locust Walk and the tampons. It took forever, haven't missed Air Penna at all. <laughs> There's an elevator this time, which is so nice. Locked out yet again. This is the common room, hallway, and huge closet. Got a little kitchen. There's no dishwasher, but there is a stove. It came with a microwave and a nice little sink. Let's just check out the bathroom, shower, and a toilet, which has been cleaned since the last time I visited, so that's good. My friend Alexa and Alyssa are moving in here. This one is my room, B, and Natalie's room is this one. Sadly, she also got a smaller room this time. <laughs> it's so big. I actually think that my other room was larger, but this one is not shabby. The one quirky part about this is that this entire wall is a window overlooking Locust Walk. And I'm on the third floor, so people can definitely see into my room. This is low key scary. I'm going to wipe down every surface. As you can tell, it's actually pretty clean in here. It's really just the ground that needs to be clean. Look at that. Ew. Uh, I got a little goodie bag with reasonable utensil. Notices to vote. Pen sustainability. Fun fact, Pen only has a few compost stains around here. Nat and I left a lot of our stuff actually in Philly. So this is just clothing. I think I'm going to unpack it so I have the bags and then go get my stuff, put it in these bags and bring it back in carts. We're getting a car, it is getting warmer. Somehow finesse two cars. a whole family affair. We just did a little swapsies because Atticus can't get into our building so I'm going to bring this little bag by myself which is not working that well because <laughs> I'm filming. So heavy. I'm literally working up a sweat. We're back on the third floor and it's so fun because my room is literally straight down the hall. My mattress topper. Beautiful little microwave with the problem is you already have one so I guess we just have two. And finally, my mini fridge, which I don't really have a use for anymore because we have a normal fridge. <laughs> Funny story actually, when I was moving out, I had put my mini fridge inside of a cart and left it outside to go get more. Somebody took out my mini fridge, like from the cart and put it on the ground and then just took my moving cart. Like, are you kidding? So people are just very entitled. So if you're watching it and that was you outside of Rodney, I'm disappointed. We're doing another swap these. Intercepted. 
cozy in here. Tall, tall. Headboard. We've moved in a lot of the big stuff. We got our stuff from storage and are heading back. Final shipment. You can't even tell how much stuff is here. <laughs> we have all of our stuff. Also, Alyssa's family is here now and we are moving it all in. Oh, okay. <laughs> it doesn't reach across the room. My rug is set up thanks to Atticus. It doesn't quite reach under my bed, but that's okay because it reaches all the way under my desk. And I did it so that the door can close without covering it. Oh, Alyssa's favorite. also moving in. Look at Alyssa's room. That Similar nice to Natalie's. Stomans. Nice. Spying on all of you. Now I'm gonna move all my clothing. This is actually not even all my clothing. Look at all my clothing into my closet. I feel like I'm like 50% moved in, which is pretty good. Hopefully this spot doesn't suck. But anyways, I'm going to bring all my stuff from the cart so we can return the carts because we're not supposed to have it for more than an hour, which I forgot on, so. Oops. I have my canvases from my Big Little Beach. Charles River in Boston. This is a photo that my friend sent in. This is all my stuff from Big Little Week. I just didn't know what to do with it, so I just packed it all. Pinata! Why do I have this? All my stuff is in my room now. The living room is getting emptier now that we've moved all of our stuff. Alyssa has all of her stuff with college butler, which is so much nicer and neater than what I had. <laughs> Taking the cart back, finally. Atticus is doing the most and dying in his feet. We were just asked if Atticus and I were twins. <laughs> I don't know if we look that similar. What do you guys think? Leave pretty. in the comments. <laughs> Getting stuff up from Amazon. We have all of our stuff. Well, Atticus and I got our Amazon stuff. Nat's room has been getting situated. It looks pretty good. I realized that this is not actually the only place that you can hang stuff. You can actually hang stuff under here and here. First things first, I think I need to find my hangers so I can start putting away stuff. I was in literally such a rush to leave the quad because I had just finished my finals and they kicked us out like the day of, from what I remember. So that's why none of this is organized. I have so much AB stuff. The jacket, I'm glad I didn't bring home. Yes! Why do I have this? The bag. Shower caddy. See, my party dresses, I didn't need at home. This stuff is so random. Have fun, 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 It is 5.50 and here's a little update on the status of my room. We've got the desk basically set up, raise the desk so that the cabinets can fit underneath. I need to move this stuff out because I'm going to move this back. Lots of clothing, stuff from Big Little Week that I still need to figure out. And I have no sheets because they're not clean. <laughs> I just took a break to go on a meeting for my pre-orientation program that I am a mentor for. Advancing women in engineering, fun fact. Now I'm going to rally and try to finish putting all of this clothing into my closet. I got a bit more progress. That's going to be hidden under my bed. Now we're gonna go to dinner. Basically a wrap for today's move-in. This is really random and the lighting in my room is absolutely horrendous, but I was trying to close this because I need to change. However, look at this. I can't close it all the way because the last owner of this room left it in such a tangle. So now I'm gonna try and untangle this. Guys, we're making progress. I'm doing a bit of shopping because there's still some stuff I need to get. 
It's very dark in my room, so I'm about to see if my lights from last year still work. Hopefully nothing breaks. Okay, let's go! Sana and I are mentors for a pre-orientation program and we get a little one hour break, so I'm going to go pick up some stuff from Amazon right now. Back again. I just got a huge package. I just got four pillows. Also got command hooks finally to put up my lights. As you can tell, I've been sleeping in my bed. My room is an actual wreck. I don't even have sheets. I'm trying to get my stuff together. I have pillows finally that I'm going to stuff into here. So I saw this hack on TikTok, which is get pillows that are two inches larger than what you actually have for the pillowcase, because then it makes the pillows seem a lot fuller and just nicer. I just got some 20 by 20 inch pillows because the pillowcases I have are 18 by 18 inch. So we'll see if this hack works. Okay, this is very long. This framing is so bad. I apologize. <gasps> in this hack, it basically said, keep the original insert that goes in it and then just put in this to make it extra stuff. This pillow is definitely very, very, very stuffed. Oh my gosh, this feels so much nicer. Look at the difference. I don't know if you can tell, but this one's definitely a lot heftier and feels a lot nicer. One down, four to go. Four pillows, done. As you can tell, my room is pretty messy. I'm going to be putting up these command hooks, putting up my lights, which will be one more thing, off of my floor. I've been procrastinating so much on dealing with all the clothing on my ground and unpacking that. I'm finally gonna do it. I finally have clean sheets! Yay! At Amazon getting a lot of stuff. Just picked up more stuff from Amazon! I put up even more wallpaper. Putting up the final strip of wallpaper. Thank you, Natalie. Okay guys, so it is the last day before classes start and I think I've moved in, I guess, much faster than last year's, which took like the course of a month. I will show you my room and stay tuned for the room tour because I'm sure this will change. Yes, I do film with my phone. It's my bed, my closet. On my desk. Lots of trash. <laughs> Feels pretty organized. Definitely some work to be done. Everything is moved in and I am obsessed with this wallpaper. I will be putting up artwork over the course of the next few months, I'm sure, but art is a bit of a commitment, it feels like, so I think that I'm just gonna post this move-in video because everything has been like moved into my room for the most part. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Like, subscribe, stay tuned for the room tour and other pen-related content. I think that school's gonna get very, very hectic because it is my sophomore year and I'm gonna have a lot of really hard engineering classes, but hopefully I'll be able to post some more soon. See you guys in my next video.